Welcome back to another episode of Bennett. Do some exploration. And this time we are going further towards Araumi, which is uh, this northern part of, what was it? Narukami Island. And also we have to do some exploration down here, but for now we are going to concentrate on Araumi. So, onwards, I say, onwards. On another note, I also have to check uh, what else we can find up there because it seems to be also very, very, very special. Anyhow, let's just climb that little mountain. Say little mountain over here. And these are somehow new-ish kind of enemies. What is this? Ah, chunks. Why am I even doing that? <laughs> I have Noel in my squad. There is no reason why it shouldn't go quick. Alright. So, what are you? Ooh, is this a trap? What is this? It uh, turns into these thingies. Okay, it can uh, launch rockets that are not really targeting the swallow that. Uh, okay. It has some interesting beamy thingy abilities. But I can uh, destroy it with ease. I just don't know what its weakness is. Strange creature. What about this thing? Nah. It has no energy in it. That's why nothing happens. Also, why? Ah, uh, some items and the chaos axes and the chaos gear. Interesting. Comes from a now inactive ruin machine. Even the great tech. What is it? Uh, this thing. Even the great techniques and unknown power of this device must come to nothing should the machine that contained them ever fail to maintain structural integrity. Oh, okay. And uh, this is the energy source of the biomimetic machine. Whatever biomimetic means. <laughs> I can kind of understand the word bio, but that is just it. Anyhow, uh, we have an interesting uh, area down here with multiple... Uh -huh. With multiple other things, a nice barrier. And a fox statue. Okay, and usually the fox statue shows me that this is somewhat related to the mission. Um, this uh, cleansing defilement thing. And of course, I have to fall in there first, I believe. Yeah. Whoa. What happened? Oh, so if I get too close to it, uh, it will start to move. That's just great. And this is probably ah, another enigmatic page. Oh, wait. Okay, how can this thing even attack me if I'm like that far away from it, makes no sense. All right, anyway, uh, let's just climb high up. Yeah, let's just climb high up. Nice. It's not possible to climb high up because, damn it, this thing is cheating. Oh, we can actually uh, go outside, that's interesting. So I can't pass through the barrier, but this uh, ruin guard thing can, that's neat. It would actually be extremely nice if I can, let's say, uh, control this creature and uh, use it to traverse those barriers. Then I can just uh, deactivate them from within or something. Maybe uh, push a button or whatnot. Anyway, um, I think, yeah, uh, I am definitely going to change the party a little bit. Sometimes I use the hotkey for it, and sometimes I use this uh, menu button thingamajig thing. Bam! Alright. So, onwards we go again. There was a Fatui up here. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. No, 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 no. Okay, more Fatui. No, 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 come on. There we go. Just have to get uh, rid of the shield somewhat. Come on, just get the strike. Perfect. One down. Two to go. Bruh. 
Okay, let's get a nice... No, this is the wrong interaction. Oh, wait. Like, look at this. I am doing, like, overload damage, but for some reason, it just does not destroy the shield, which is weird. So, I uh, fire shield can... be destroyed quicker with... I don't know what we need. Uh, water, probably. Like, there's always a, like, a damage thing, like, pure damage reaction, and then there is a uh, shield damaging reaction. Because there are always two of them. Woo. Well, most of the time there are two of them, at least. Come on. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Look, look at this. How much damage am I even doing towards that, like, 2,000? That's it. If I'm just uh, dishing physical damage, Normally, right, I would just deal more damage altogether. I think it's uh, ice that you can use in order to destroy the electro shield, and so you can trigger superconduct, and then uh, water probably for, for the fire shield. Or it's the other way around, and you need water for electro in order to short it a little bit, and then you would need. What was the other thing? What is this? EC. Okay. Uh, as I said, water for electro and ice probably for uh, for the pyro effect. Alrighty. So now I'm high up and the only thing left to do is falling down. Perfect. Uh, or just for a normal, huh, or in other words, common chest. Absolutely great. Absolutely great. Anyway, uh, I got the uh, electro cue, so I can just get rid of this thing. So, what do we have down here? A cam. Uh, let's ignore the cam for now. I want to go up uh, on top of that mountain again, just so I can figure out what else we can find up here. Because I have a strange suspicion that there's other stuff that you can get. Okay, there's the maiden again. But this maiden is the... Uh, yeah, one next to the ghost area. And a one, and a two, and a three, come on. There we go. Hmm. Come on. Hey, another maiden. Is it the same one? Ooh. Ah, look at this. Now we can uh, interact with this uh, statue again. Mm. And we can get some nice answers off of it. Perfect. Come on, get the story. No, don't, 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 don't disappear in your little uh, mirror thingy. Come on. And the nice ultimate, and we got it. There we go. Easy mode. Oh, some nice polarizing thingies as well. So, how does that thing work? What does it do? Maybe it just triggers another side mission for me. Hmm. Oh, okay. But can you do this twice? I don't know. Yeah, you can actually do this twice. <laughs> but do we get the same these 13 years of life floated by like a dream someone's voice uh, strange 13 years of life maybe all of this is somewhat uh, connected to uh, yeah another side mission whatever and you can find 
few more of those fox statues right hmm. the thing is i would have at least expected some come on where are you why can't i just push her a little bit forward how much damage was that 7,000 damage, sometimes. Hmm. Right. there we go. Time to get some nice prisms again. Nice, nice, nice. Huh. Yeah, still, it's a very, very strange area. Hmm. Ah, uh, okay. Where do we go? Where do we go? Where do we go? Where do we go? Uh, I just go somewhere, really. You see any chests? Maybe, maybe not. Okay, how far until I reach the top? Yeah, so I can just jump. And another one. So let's just get the stamina back. And the last few jumps, and we are all the way up there. The thing is, uh, I believe I was here before. Kind of looks familiar, really. Yeah. It could be that this was where the. Uh, where I got my travel log. I could just be it. Alright, but from high up here, we can actually see so much better. And that's the waypoint. I can just uh, trigger this one again. But this fox statue here, that basically gives it way that we uh, enter an interesting area with probably rude or whatever. Uh, come on, and another one. Damn it, don't just push this up forward like that. It's so nice that you can actually not turn around. <laughs> the animal boxes are the ones I like to fight the most. Right, one, two, three, bam, and one, two. Do -do 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 hmm. But yeah, I'm actually thinking about uh, getting maybe a water-ish kind of squad so I can use vaporize in it. Maybe I should go with like water and uh, cryo just to get the frost effect. Why was he healed? Oh, I think I know what's happening. Like this uh, dude with the water cannon is able to heal his allies. I think this is what's going on here. Very interesting. Like I have to, yeah. Damn it. I have to make sure that he won't get hit by those uh, large water bubbles so he doesn't regenerate. It's actually quite interesting, them having healers as well. Alright, let's just, uh, was it? I think water uh, can be destroyed much quicker with frost or so. Oh, it doesn't look like it. There we go. Oh, the damage. The damage. Out of this world. But it's only Elbido that's the reason why I'm dishing out so much. All the others? Nah. Basically nothing. So yeah, this one is already charged, so... Hmm. Back to Aromi we go. Maybe what I have to do uh, is defeat this strange device thingy, uh, which is underground. So I have to go through the portal down there. Uh, hmm. Or interact with uh, other strange thingies, who knows. But let's just uh, have a little bit more of a look around here. Uh, get up on this mountain. And see what else we can find on top of it. Other than, of course, the waypoint. The single and only thing up here. Yep. 
Sad. Okay. Do we have anything else up here? I don't think so. Like a when... Probably run around it. Yeah. I went around here. Through the bottom. With a ship and so on. Yeah, there's Kid Kuchirai again. Alright. Wait a minute. Down here? That makes no sense. Wait a minute. Uh, let's mark this thing. This is Kid Kuchirai. Kid. Uh. Uh. Ooh. And there we go. Whoa, look at that. Ah. I think I popped it with an awful lot of damage and then it just poof, fell down immediately. So, uh, what do we have here? We have a totem thingy down here. And this has to be triggered with... Okay, this is guarded, so I have to do something. Mm, to rotate them. Okay. What about the ones down here? Okay, the ones at the bottom don't move. Oh, just like... Okay. I just brute force the thing. I just uh, wanted to figure out how they are connected. And in the meantime, I kind of solved it. Uh, which is... Which is a good thing. Alright. So, let's uh, trigger this thing. Which stays active forever, which is great. Then there was also... Uh, another one which is down here. It's number two. And... Ah! Huh. So there are multiples around. Interesting. So there's another one. It could be that they are spread uh, around here, but... Uh, the lines down there don't tell you where the next one might be. Uh, like I... Yeah, one here, one here, one here. The next one could be somewhere behind uh, the tree, or maybe even inside it. Let's see. Ah, there's another one. And there's a biggie as well. Okay, what do we have here? Ooh, nice. Okay, still got the damage boost active. Sweet. Just a few more hits and it's done. Alright. So, there was something I could interact with and it was, of course, a very, 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 very large chest. Precious one. Oh. I would just really like to see a 5-star set for uh, the initial kind of items that you find in this game. Like Traveler's... Uh, traveling Doctor, or what was the other one? Uh, adventure, or whatnot. So, yeah, that might just be the last one. Yeah. Oh, that's an awfully large area. Interesting. So, it's not shooting itself, it kind of marks the area. And after the marking happened, uh, there's some strike that occurs from the sky. Like a drone strike almost. Or an orbital strike. Wait a minute. Why is there this other creature all around? Maybe it just got triggered once I get too close to it. Okay. Got another one. And there we go. Kind of like those enemies. They're sweet. They're easy to destroy. Um, well, not because they are easy to destroy, but they are like different somehow. 
and what about this one the chaos oculus comes from a now inactive ancient ruin machine the ruin part of the name comes from the areas where they are most active however ruin machines actually have little in common with the detritus in which they are often found in the ancient past these ruins were once part of a civilization mighty enough to almost touch the dome of the firmament while ruin still waits in the deep places of the earth awaiting the order to rise and thread all kingdoms underfoot nice all right and that should have triggered it right that was the last one and then yeah that was the last one uh so we have one over here one over here the other one down the right and then there's one hidden behind a puzzle which you can just brute force kind of um so let's start this thing. Uh huh. Okay. Uh, it says start, so I expect it to actually deactivate at some point. Uh. Or not. We got ourselves the precious chest, and now I can get an awful lot of uh, visions from the past. So, what about this one? Does it uh, give me another treasure chest or so? No, okay. Okay, so every time you uh, look at those little foxes, uh, you can find another device. And I expect if I trigger all of them, mm, I can... That's one. Okay, the... Uh, oh, yeah, the floor opens. Nice. Yeah. Oh, that's amazing. I love that. I absolutely love that. Oh, and I found it. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. So this is how you can uh, find your way down. And I also need the comb, uh, which means I have to get to the statue, which means I have to... Uh, yeah. Hey, this must be one of those barriers that the masked lady had. The memento lens and have a look at all of it. Okay. Ooh. There's also another kind of barrier thingy. Another nice door. So, let's uh, see. Why can't I... There we go. It probably goes towards the other pillar, is it? Yes. Uh... Damn it. Come on. Nah. Let's just charge it up again. Damn it. This Sealy is a bit annoying. And a bit is a bit of an understatement. Where is it? Okay. Slowly but surely. Ah, right here. So that might open the door. No. It gives me a chest. Maybe if I uh, trigger both of them, then I can open the door. Uh, so I have to find the other CD. Another enigmatic page. Look at that. Once I find all of them, all ten of them, or whatever. I think there are actually different uh, sets for these enigmatic pages. Ah, look at that. What does this one do? Ah, okay. So these thingies are hidden behind uh, an illusion. This will probably turn into one as well. It's kind of nice. Sometimes you get uh, memories from the past, and sometimes they just turn into useful objects altogether. Kind of neat. But it is still kind of obvious, though. Ah, there's the other one. Okay. So, all of those have to be aligned, I guess. For some reason, this uh, puzzle seems awfully simple. So, how about this one? Uh, have you seen Master Tengu Harunosuke? No, I haven't. Must be out of fighting, but don't da I'm more worried about Mr. Taki Mine. Is he da Hey, he'll be alright. He made a bet with me after all. Okay, investigate. We got ourselves the goblet. Uh, I think I can trigger this again in order to trigger the dialogue. It's... 
Where have I seen something similar? Hey, have you seen Mr. Tengu Haru? Da, 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 da. Chieftain of the Yongu Tengu, we are talking about here. Okay. So some chieftain disappeared. Uh, ah, there's another chest. That's weird. It's not working. There. Was this the Celia I found before? Oh. Maybe there's even... Uh, there are even some items hidden up here. Who knows? Please don't... Oh, okay. The Celia's always like to get to the high up spaces, right? There we go. Lights will guide you, sure. Ah. Now this is nice. This is absolutely nice. Okay. Now I can enter uh, this strange ruin. That's great. That's absolutely great. Um, but this ruin, right? Uh, the strange ruin down here. There's still more that I can do. Mm, because I have to lower the water levels as well. So, what else was there? Um, this uh, may either give me another item. Uh, or it gives me access to... This magic one thingy. Oh, look at that. Ah, okay. Or it could just lower the water levels. So what about the one in the center? The one in the center doesn't work. That means that this one tells me, because there's a stone on top of it, uh, where the rest have to be aligned to. So this one here moves the leftmost. Well, what does it? I don't know. Ah, so three of them are connected. So it's always the corners that turn around. I think this is it. Yes. Uh, and the water level decreased as well. Please don't fall. Oh, shit. And one of it fell down, uh, as usual. So, now that the water level uh, is a bit lower. Not low enough, though. This is a very, 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 very... Oh, this reminds me of an... Area, uh, very annoying one, by the way. Uh, which game was it? Soul Reaver. There was an underground or like underwater area, and the only way through was to swim. But as long as you are in the water, you can't really fight. You were always getting attacked by shark uh, enemies. That was so horrible. And there's our electrocule. Okay. Don't want to use up too much stamina. I need like a space to stand on for now. So the centerpiece here is not just... It's there to help you, I presume. Yes. Okay. Now to boost your stamina. Come on. And... Now we are ready to swim on. Ah, ha. Huh. Okay. Yeah, this is part of the rest of the thing. Wow. Let's hope this is a permanent thing. Ah! So it has multiple entrances and exits and whatnot. And now the water level really is lower, but it has to get lowered even more. Hmm. Okay. What do we have here? An old stone slate. Very important. So, uh, the... F Wait a minute. Okay, so it can still rotate. Sometimes they are fixed and sometimes they are not. Um, maybe I should use the explosion uh, for it, whatever. Like, okay, if I get the one in the center, it moves the ones to the left. This one is connected to the... Okay. This one connects the two of them. Uh, okay, I think I can do this now. Kind of. Kind of. Oh, uh, no. Nah, this might not be it. Um... Uh, 
Uh, why is it that the connection is so iffy? Ah, okay. So the one on the left and the one on the right are symmetric. Mm. This one moves these three, this one moves these three, I presume? Yeah, okay. Now I know. And this one moves the one in the center and the ones uh, on the right. The easiest way is to you just use binary code and to hit them after another, and then you just cycle through all of the different uh, possibilities, really. Um, but it could take a little while, so let's just use our brains a bit. So this one and this one. Um... Uh, nah, not quite. Oh? Oh, that's convenient. Okay. Can't really describe it. I would just say it's kind of brute force and strange feeling. Hey, no ruin god. Now the water is gone. That's perfect. And uh, that one cannot be interacted with, sadly. So, what do we have down here? Ah! So, this is the way out. Nice. Ah, and with the water level gone, this... Where does this one go? Another tunnel thingy. Goes this way. Ooh! Come on. Do, 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 do. I have to be careful to not uh, use the crystallize ability all the time. Because it kind of sucks up the damage. That's a bit iffy. What I mean by this is I want to get the uh, overload thing all the time. But it always turns into crystallized because of this uh, flower effect. That's why I have to use the elemental abilities like twice in a row and switch to the next character or something. There we go. Oh, wait. Always oh, attack from the back. Uh, Kinda. Nice thing about the flower thing uh, is that it doesn't matter how the enemy are oriented, damage will always happen. Oh, there's also a way. Ah, this is the underground waypoint. Just for ease of use, let's just trigger this waypoint down here. Or ease of access, mostly. Whoa. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Very nice. Alright, uh, let's just quickly go back and continue the exploration of this... Ah, the strange ruin that we found. So the normal way is just over there. There's one way through here. This is just the puzzle thing. And then... There we go. Uh, there's this one. Yeah. This one turns into a normal robot thingy. And that one too. Okay. Oh, 
I just go all out on these things. Okay, one of them is done. Okay, why is it that they are both kind of stunned right now? Like, I don't seem to attack their weak point, eh? I mean, you need to use your bow for this. Huh. Somehow I triggered the the good hit on it. Ah, and that one is just somewhere below. Can't really interact with it, sadly. Okay, mm, now we have this thingy down here now. How do you get there? Uh, not from the top. So I, what I have to do is I have to walk around and find myself another one of these. Uh, ah, found it. Yeah, now this is uh, this really gives it away. Wait a minute. Huh? There's nothing here. No item. No anything. That's strange. Whatever. This one. This right here. Okay. Now we have to be fast. Mm, come on, get through the barrier. Uh, what? Okay. So, what about this one? Easy device. Yeah, there's still uh, an electric yule in here. Uh, ruin. I should also yes. maybe uh, label it barrier just in case. Um, barrier. So, now that I know I have to level up the uh, barrier thingy. Hmm. What else can I try to do? Is there another entrance or something? This is the only other entrance and this one is just there to uh, purify the thing. But did, uh, did I actually ever go through here? Huh. Okay. So the purification thing it just works. Found it. There's a fox statue with a ward right there. Nice. Uh Paman remembers that we gotta use Electro on it, so bam. Got it. Scroll shape ward. No matter what you do. Uh it's a special one. Scroll shape ward. This one. Um an ancient and mysterious item shaped like a tightly sealed scroll. No matter what you do, it won't open at all. According to Kasari, these wards are needed to conduct the sacred Sakura cleansing ritual. So then let's conduct said ritual. And then we can continue the exploration of Araumi uh, down below. So how does this one work? Ah, it's a complicated one. So it's one. Uh Two, two on the edges. So this is two, and this is also supposed to be two. Can I like... Ah, okay. You have to climb up there and interact with it. Uh, yeah, this is two. So two and two are working. One, two, and... Yeah. Three and three. Hmm. Damn it. Okay. That uh, should do the trick just fine. Nice. But it's only one samurai, not two of them, so something is weird. Maybe it's only one samurai because there's no story connected to it also it's just a normal ish kind of purification <laughs> purification and that's it Ooh. okay a bit more damage and we good 
Oh, the vaporize does absolutely no bonus damage whatsoever. There we go. No cutscene, no nothing. Cleansing to farm and is done. Yee! Ah, Paimon thought this castle would suddenly appear behind us. Well, whatever the case, this is the fifth and final route. Paimon was sure that after this last one, she would suddenly appear behind us with a poof and give us the treasure. Well, we have to go to the first one uh, in uh, Kondo Village, I believe. Konda? Kondo? Kon Konda Village. Uh, poof. What do you mean? Well, like poof. What else uh, is it supposed to be like? Anyway. Guess we finished the Sacred Sakura cleansing ritual. Hmm, quite the breeze, eh? <laughs> uh, for sure. We walked almost the entire Narukami Island and even went to the bottom of the sea. Paimon is so tired. Well, I'm the only tired one here. Hmm, hey, 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 Paimon's been cheering you on really hard, okay? Uh, didn't Miss Mask uh, Maiden say that we should go back to her after pur purifying all five roots? Hey, Paimon's sure we'll get a reward. Well, let's enter the barrier in the well in Kondo Village to find her. Paimon's ready for that treasure, as long as it's not Tanuki food again. Okay, and with the change of the name of the quest, we are continuing uh, with this one, at least, in the other episode. And for now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to continue the exploration of this underground ruin thingy. And get myself some nice items. And you need. Hey, we can cook. And we can destroy. Bennett, the destroyer of worlds. Hit of pots. Hello there. Oh, the acting instructor Mifune Satoshi. Are we pursued? What? <laughs> Let's see if I can uh, distract him with that. Oh, what kind of damage was that? Like 10,000. And that was it. Like whistle in the wind. Nice, 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 nice. So. But that's just it. Like a special samurai. A little bit of loot. Yeah. <laughs> Those caches for some reason are just so nice. They only give you 500 more though, but... I kind of need... What is this... Magical ship thing. I mean, it looks very strange. Almost as if you can walk on the ceiling. Was it? Wow. Wait a minute. Did I pick up the? Uh... Oh no, the electro cube was behind a barrier. Uh, I need to increase the sacred sakura tree in order to obtain that one. I was wondering, like, when I would be able to, like, or if I actually obtain some electrocules or not. And the answer is no. Well, at least some of them might. Uh, what are the special ones? Yeah, one electrocule, not enough to spend. 66, like, two upgrades for the tree. And what else? Ah, there's another one right on the other side. But now, because of the whole change of water levels and so on, I am finally able to walk around it. Uh, yeah, get through the barriers. Ah, now I understand. Like, the barrier uh, kept it from... from flooding, basically. That's what happened. Ooh. Interesting puzzle. Um, it says go forward. No. Wait, wait. Okay, that's not how it works. Ah, uh, okay. Think I know how this is done. Uh, you have to light up all of the tiles and end up with the one... Let's hide it. There we go.
Now this is a nice puzzle. Because it's a constructive one. Ah, this one opens the other domain. Ah, uh, bollocks. Okay, that can take a while. Um, I could... I think I know how this is done. Same way as the others before. It just looks more complicated. But the thing that you have to do is just walk around again. Uh, like that. And you have... Bollocks! Okay, that's not something that I wanted to see here. Let's try this again. Uh, I stepped a little bit. So you cannot step on the same tiles twice. Just something to keep in mind. Oh yeah, wait a minute. There's some problem here as well. Uh, yeah, I think there's a little bit of a problem. Mm, because I can't get to this tile here. So what I have to do is like walk around like that again. Uh, there we go. And keep this path free for me. Okay. Easy mode. I wanted to go like round twice like in a spiral-ish kind of uh, pattern. But that was definitely not it. Okay, what do we got? Uh, to think the master said, da, 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 blah, this place reeks of fox, blah, 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 blah. Mm -hmm. You activate a mechanism and all of a sudden the like, thing explodes. And in here we get. What is this? Investigate. Uh, artifacts. Sweet. Oh, yeah, we have to trigger it, of course. I don't need to get into here. Well, it is a single domain, is it? Yeah, but I can just teleport here at a tutelage, a thousand scrolls. What is this? Uh, samurai. This was once the final abode of the Tango Warriors incarnate. Having since forgotten the world, it falls to you to solve the riddle they left behind and defeat the trespassing bandits. <laughs> Recommended elements. All of them. <laughs> uh, what kind of recommendation is this? Uh, anyway, this is definitely something that I need to do here. Like this little domain. Um, this one here, the Court of Flowing Sand, also doesn't really count because I'm not interested in this talent material. Then same goes for this one. And this is also a special one, Tutelage Castle of Scrolls. That might be uh, Tutelage King of Thieves. Uh, so there are three of them, one for each island, basically. Interesting. It also looks as if the Narukami Island is actually the largest one. Like, this is almost the same size, but the... Yeah. I can definitely explore that fairly quickly. So... But the other thing that I wanted to do is have a bit more of a look around. And figure out if there are more items for me to get or not. Like there could be some hidden chests yes. and leashes okay. around. Yeah. That down here. Uh, what is this? Yes. It's a way okay. towards this creature thingy. I don't want to get too close to it because I kind of know how this thing works. Also, how often can you defeat this thing? 40. Um, 40 means it's kind of like a normal-ish kind of boss. Not that interested in it this way. So, uh -huh. I think you can hmm, step across like this. Uh -huh. Nice. Perfect. What about this memento? Does it turn into anything? Does it give me another text? Big brother Michihida, don't worry. Da, da, da. I know she'll be back after all. She's. Oh. Poor girl, not coming back at all. Hmm. 
Okay. All right. So yeah, I got the electrocule. There are no other chests up here, or at least I'm not that keen on finding them. This was the. Where did it actually come from? Um, this path here. Or this path. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, how did I get down here actually? Through a teleport thingy. I, but I just don't know where I arrived. Thank goodness it's none of those hit your head situation. Uh, was this? Yeah, okay, so this is where I came from. And now I only have to fly down. No, this is just the staircase. It just leads up. If you're too lazy to climb. Yep, nothing else that you can do. And this cube thingy kind of looks like one of those hypostases, to be honest. Really neat. Alright, now we got all of that. Uh, the strange ruin we did. Except for that barrier that is down here. Uh, which is the easy death ruin. Yeah, this thing. Um... Strange ruin we can delete now. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Alright. Looks like I am going up again. Towards the um, thingy. <laughs> towards the tree. Level it up. And with a bit of luck I can get... Huh. Oh, almost three times you gotta be kidding me. Huh. Once more for level 4. Don't even know what I get for that. So, what is level 4? Uh, if your active character is Electro, you deal bonus damage. Sure. Hmm. Nice. Can only happen once every 6 seconds. Can it happen multiple times? The CD of Electrogram's coordinated attack is 4 seconds. Ah, okay, so it lowers. If a character in the party whose elemental type is in it will increase damage by Electrogram coordinated attacks by 20%. So this increases the damage. This also does some coordinated thingies, but this one with AOE. And carrying the alignment, you can now block... Okay. Pass through advanced... Oh, okay, level 12, that's a bit... Hmm. Damage increase again. Duration increase. Number of coordinated attacks required for an electronic to activate a lightning blast is decreased to two. Hmm. So I got the level up, but I'm still not able to pass through any barriers. Wait a minute. Um. There. Level six is necessary to get through a slightly more difficult barrier. Level six. Goodness. So it's two more level ups then, is it? Yeah. Two more level ups, uh, that means I have to get another... F I wanted to say 25, but it's not 25. 25 plus 3, 28. Okay. This sacred <laughs> tree thing that takes ages. Uh, Alright. Let's develop the situation. So that I can... Ah, bollocks. I don't know if I already did the commissions or not. Hmm. Uh, did I finish some? Of course not. Of course not. You gotta be kidding me. Because this is the overarching mission, Sacred Sakura Cleansing Ritual. That means that uh, I have to go there and finish it. Get to be kidding me. Yeah, right down there in the Biaco Plains. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. But this is definitely something that I'm gonna do at another time. And for now, I'm just gone, going to upgrade the uh, 
There we go. Statue of the Seven a little bit. With... How many do I even have? Two of them. Uh, doesn't give me that much. But now I know that's another nine needed. Awful lot. An awful lot. <laughs> Unbelievable. Anyway. Let's end it for now. And continue with the rest of the cleansing ritual at the next episode. <laughs> like and subscribe, of course. Ta-ta.